Dear Football and Blowjob Magazine, I'm a longtime fan of your publication. I really like football, and of course, I love a good blowjob. That's why I was so excited by something that happened to me at a local sports bar. It was Monday night, and I'd made plans to watch the Jets game with my buddies and later meet up with my girlfriend for some late night dinner and a blowjob. As it turns out, both sets of plans fell true. So I headed down to Hummers, a local sports bar that shares its name with a slang term for oral sex. It's my favorite bar. Upon entering, I met a beautiful woman named Betty. I asked her, what's the score? She said, me and my boyfriend like to bring strangers back to our place for a game of football catch and blow jobs. Wow, and I thought these were just stories in football and blow job forum. We made a quick stop at the corner store for some chips, pretzels, cheese dip, chicken wings, beer, and mouthwash. Two blocks later, we reached Betty and Todd's studio apartment. I turned on the TV, Betty set up the snacks, and Todd changed into his high school football uniform. Great place you got here, I told them. Shut up, Todd grunted, and give me a blow job. I won't bore you with the details of what followed, but I can tell you this, I was glad we bought that mouthwash. I wish this was the first time something like this had ever happened, or rather, I wish none of those other times had ever happened. Either way, I think there should be some way to distinguish if a woman wants to give you a blowjob, or have you give her boyfriend a blowjob while she tosses a football at you. Yours truly, John Madden. Huh. Oh, Mark Sanchez weighs in on the Dirty Sanchez. This ought to be interesting. A lot of people think that just because my name is Sanchez that I like to rub doo-doo on girls' faces like it's a goatee. Well, nothing could be further from the truth. <laughs>